constituted authority, add this to the six that we would pick up on the road in Bridge Run, which would give us 14 cents to build a right-of-way farm with. After the presentation, Commissioner Noel Price acted as spokesman for the court. He said the court had discussed several months ago the acceptance of moving eight cents from the bridge and road fund and earmarking those funds for emergency right-of-way buying, thus giving the county the emergency funds and without any tax increase. Commissioner Frank Crowley summed it up this way. Friendly in a cordial meeting, and uh, I think everyone went away feeling that his viewpoint had been expressed, and frankly, I think the problem uh, is one that lends itself to solution. And what will that be? I think the commissioners have, in effect, agreed to pledge the total reserves in the Road and Bridge Fund to right-of-way purchase, should that become necessary in this calendar year. Frankly, I'm of the opinion even though roads may be approved, that we'll be unable effectively to spend as much as three and a half to four million dollars in this calendar year. I'd be very surprised if we did. No tax increases in the offing. When the court broke up, the battle over the Woodall Rogers Freeway was at a temporary standstill. It's sure to come up again before long. And everyone left seemingly satisfied, at least for the time being. At Dallas County Commissioner's Court, this is Carl Mayo.